for the push test, if you have a freedom trainer, that would be ideal, where you would bring the arms in and down to about chest level, give or take, and you'll have enough room so you can go inside the arms, but not much more. From here, you'll grab the handles, straighten the arms, walk forward a little bit, and then from here, elbows are slightly bent, because I'm so, I believe you're not supposed to lock your arms, you're going to do a walk this way for 45 seconds. This mimics the amount of time it takes to do the six arches 180 degree that you have to do for your test. If you don't have a setup like this, use the cable machine that is much wider, but bring those weights in, walk forward, and do it there as well. The weight for the test is 80 pounds. Don't worry about that with the machine because cable machines do not reflect actual weight. So just work on it, pick a load that's challenging, and slowly, week by week, increase the amount of weight you're lifting. But don't rush. you got three to four months right now as I'm filming this. So take the time you need, proper form, get stronger in the positions, and build a strong foundation so that when it's testing time, you're ready to crush it.